It looks like this game's gotten quite a few updates since last time I played. Space button to blink. Just follow me. Oh, and by the way, we're authorized to kill any disobedient test subjects, so don't try anything stupid. Okay. I see that they haven't really updated any of the animations. All personnel report to game immediately. That sounds so, good. Uh, how's it going? Um, good. Are you talking to me? Yeah, who do you think I'm talking to? This guy here with the punchable face? He walks like he shit himself. He's also kind of bending his leg farther back than the legs naturally go. Well, we're here. Just get in there and follow all the instructions, and uh, you'll probably be fine. Don't don't give me this probably be fine shit. I'm not particularly down with that idea. You guys can do that. That's uh, fine. There seems to be a problem with the door control system. The door isn't responding to any of our attempts to close it. So please maintain direct eye contact with SCP-173. Okay. Oh no. 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 Open the door. Open the door. Where's the door? Oh god. Oh no. Please open. Oh god. I'm so fucked. Alright. Maybe down here. Fuck. Oh god, why is that all burnt there? I'm so fucked. Ah. Okay. I'm alright for now. It's not following me. This room's open, though. Oh god, I remember why I don't play this game anymore. What's with the rumbling? Oh, shit! Okay. I had way too much coffee before playing this game. It's not gonna be good for my heart rate. I'm going the other way. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Okay, we're leaving. Bonehead? What do you mean, bonehead? Ah! Shit! Oh, fuck. Okay. 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 Oh no, it's gonna be in here, isn't it? It's gonna be fucking in here, I know it. Jesus, why do you have to be everywhere? Fuck off! Fuck off! No. Okay. Nope! This game isn't as scary as I'm making it out to be. It's just because I've had way too much fucking caffeine. I've had a pot and a half of caffeine today. We can figure out what SCP-1123 is. It's safe, whatever it is. Uh, don't touch. Well... Normal logic would say don't fucking touch the skull that makes you freak out, but that's not what this fucking game's about. So, oh, only gonna stream this for about an hour. Last time I, w I was streaming this, I didn't stream it all that much. Just be oh shit! What? Will you please fuck off with that? All right. Here's the strategy. Come here, piece of shit. I know you're fucking in there. It can't kill you, it can't move until you blink. Hopefully it's locked outside the room. Okay, it is. Watch the corners of the screen when I blink. Just kept in that cell. Uh, let's see. 
In the event, an alert will sound. Personnel should watch for any flickering movements under the corner of their eye and report immediately if one is sighted. It's a creature of unknown genus, approximately two meters long, head to tail, weighing approximately 45 kilograms. Is long, thin body and eight pairs of narrow limbs. Analysis has shown that muscle fibers are blah, blah, blah. In place of eyes or ears, it has, okay, capable of not only echolocation, but also detecting energy transfers such as the electrical impulses of the brains of nearby beings. 372 has learned time its movements with those pulses, predicting the movements of any being around it. Uses this be a technique to hide, basically, right behind you at all times. He should be in this cage, but he's fucking not. He's now following me because he thinks it's fucking funny. And this is where we die. In this room, alone, with the guy that... I don't think he can open doors, so... And we leave this place. That didn't sound like a friendly room. We're going somewhere else. Good. Creepy fun time friend is now chasing us too. So we got the stop oh, fucking shit, really? SCP-178 is a pair of white stereoscopic 3D glasses with a rectangular white frame of transparency. Left and right. Plastic in the item exhibits no unusual physical properties apart from a slight discoloration of cardboard consistent with its age. Well, so it's just a normal pair of fucking... I mean, there's got to be something special to it. Like, when you put them on, you see everyone that you've ever wronged. Not all SCPs are terrible things that want to kill you. That is true. Some of them are just like... There's one that's just like a genie that grants, grants wishes. So does this mean that scary dude is not gonna be here? Nope, he's still here. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Fuck you, fuck you. Okay, we're leaving. Of course we gotta go downstairs where the creepy ass motherfucker is. Of course not. It's not a Trixie genie, it's just a genie. There's one that's Buddha as well. I'm gonna be a little less cautious because I think it's supposed to be safe. Well, it sounds like that, I can believe it. Just screaming. People screaming in the background as they're being mutilated. Probably. Probably mutilated. There's blood here. With no real source. Okay. Okay, not that room. Oh, hey, it's the... Uh... Wait, it's Euclid? Cognohazard. Let's go see what this thing is. It's probably gonna kill me. Well, of course I need a key card for it. That's why I brought the key card. There's just a thing of blood there on the floor. Is there a piece of paper that's gonna tell me what this is? I mean, the blood is a little bit bad, but let's put them on. You put on the glasses. What is that? Oh, God. Okay, um just not let me out of the room I'm dead I actually am dead I'm stuck in this room now okay does anyone know any other room I can spawn to I mean I'm safe in here no clip oh yeah no clip is good okay whoops I think I may have lost the level Room to sit. Dawson. Dawson? Who's that? I cannot seem to leave. Well, this is what I get for cheating. Oh, no. Oh, God. Why did you put me here? Of all the places you could have put me! Nope! 
Okay. Nope. Nope. Shit, fuck you. Uh. God, I fucking hate this game. Like I said, there are... I've played a lot of horror games on stream, but this is... Why am I always fucked up on something when I play this? Like, caffeine, one time I was taking a whole bunch of steroids because of an allergic reaction. All the things that get my heart mo beating really fucking fast. And then this shit. Play it with god mode so we can beat it. Is that what you guys really want me to do? Okay. Can I turn off him? Just specifically him? I guess not. So he's still gonna be like... Fucking with me, but... I'm not gonna no clip because apparently that breaks everything. Okay, so after they complete a bit of it, they commit suicide. And they do it in their own... Blood. Uh, attempts to perform the music have resulted in a disagreeable cacophony with each instrumental part having no correlation or harmony with the instruments. If you've ever played Hotline Miami 2, think of the song Run. Or this. Hello? Okay, I could draw myself- uh, uh, Taking my hands off the keyboard and this is just happening. This is what happens when I try and walk away. Someone let it out. Is that blood? What is that? I have a thing now. Severed hand. I'm sure that's useful. Let's just go kill ourselves then. Start pushing your nails into your wrist. Tear open your left wrist and start completing the composition with your own blood. There's blood all over the floor now. We are getting farther along in the thing. It's actually writing more of it, if you noticed. You rip the wound wide open. I'm bleeding quite a bit now. There's a lot of blood now. I wonder if I'm just gonna continue bleed even though because I've got god mode on. Let's go ahead and just um Okay. Oh god, what the fuck? Alright, we're gonna leave now. Alright, so that was a bad idea. Wonder. Okay, well that didn't work. I was hoping that because I'm god mode, I can't die. Apparently it's SCP number 12. Chemical tolerance. Okay, so that could be helpful. I don't want to wear it, but I'll hold on to it. That seems like that could be helpful. Basically, like, you become stupid, but you are also, like, the Hulk. I think? I read that right? It makes you stupid. Well, there's nothing on this one. It's just a book. Okay, a book of diseases. So wait a minute. Haha, -ha, fuck you. I'm stupid as shit now and I get out of breath really easily, but I can deal with anything now. All right, what's in here? Whoa. Okay. The infinite loop. I think we have a problem here. Good thing we have all of these nice things to keep us alive. Who wants to wear the glasses again? What happens if I go near it? Good. Now this is happening. See, I like SCPs. I like the nice ones. I don't seem to have met any of the nice ones, so I don't know. Spine. Okay. I guess we're just gonna swagger around like a fucking boss. Oh, we're fine now. Good. And then we got the elevator with the dead dude in it. You alright? You have both of your hands? You do. You don't have your eyes, though. Someone should fucking fix that elevator. It's always broken. There's always some dead dude in it. It's just like, look. If you got some weird kinks where you need to do something in the elevator, that's fine. But don't stick around. Send Hall Syndrome. I don't know what that means, and that's probably going to be explained to me in about five seconds. It's probably not a good thing. OK. 
Okay. Maybe let's go the other way around to see if there's something that describes what the fuck this is. Actually, let's just see. What do you do? Okay. Oh, I've got the stupid ring on, so I can't... I can't be affected by how brilliant that piece of work is. It's good. Ah, fuck. Being dumb as balls is really helpful. Yeah, let's go into maximum security. It's like kind of a Lovecraftian thing that if you're stupid enough, you can't actually get killed. Nuking them from fucking orbit is good. Hello? Seems like a good idea. Hey, there's Kevlar over there. God, this would be a lot harder if I didn't have invincibility and this key card. And the ring of stupid. Hello? We're just not gonna deal with that right now. Hey, man. Go ahead and fucking try. I've got a Kevlar vest on. Don't give a fuck. Look, are you just gonna... We can at least get you a leash or something. You're gonna be really fucking annoying, you know that? Can you not? It makes it really hard to go places. Oh fuck, this is one of my favorite ones, right here. Hi, little bear guy. Okay, he's gone, but it's okay. He's a cute little bear. Nothing bad could possibly happen. Uh... Little bear guy? I see you're still with us. Well, come on. Teddy bear! What the fuck? Yes! The best fucking SCP. SCP-420-J. Dude, what the fuck? This shit doesn't even work. Ah, uh, I used up one? Look, you're gonna be kind of annoying if you keep following me like this. Just... Yeah, I know you're right there. I've seen you. You're fine. Oh, take off the ring. Right. Well, now that we got high. SCP-420-J is like the best weed ever. Hey, what's up, man? It's just a minute. Are you gonna let me go? I mean, I'm all for hugging too, man, but like... This game's a lot more fun, and I'm not like, you know, my heart rate's not going through the fucking roof. The blue key. Okay, well, we're in the forest now. I wonder what's going on in here. Probably should have saved. Hey, it's a thing. Wah. I did not press anything, but I guess that happened. What is this? Log 1. Memory access violation. Fail to load image. Graphics item F4.jpg. Well. I think that's where we're done then, because it failed to load a thing. 